Well, for many, it was the worst day of their lives. Three years later, those affected by Mother Nature's wrath on March 2nd, 2012, continue to put that painful chapter behind them and try to begin again. WIMT's Brandon Robinson talked to Morgan County's Judge Executive about what comes next as the journey forward continues. On March 2nd, 2012, time stood still in towns like West Liberty, Salyersville, East Bernstadt, and other communities across the mountains. Here in West Liberty, the rebuilding effort goes on, and three years later, folks here we talk to say it continues to get stronger every day. Devastated, demolished, like a war zone. Those are the words a lot of people use to describe what was left behind after the tornadoes moved through. But New Morgan County Judge Executive Stanley Franklin has passed all that. He's focused on the future, focused on making his community better. It's just neighbor helping neighbor and people pulling together is, is where we are. Um, you know, you hear that uh, well, it'll never be the same. No, it won't be the same, but we hope it'll be better. Franklin says several businesses and organizations continue to build while others decided not to return. Tonight at 6, we'll talk to more community members about what they hope to see here in the next three years and the years after that to come. In West Liberty, I'm Brandon Robinson, WIMT Mountain News. 24 people died and more than 200 were injured across Kentucky that day. The National Weather Service says a total of 18 tornadoes touched down in Kentucky, causing more than $150 million in damage.